morning, everybody. Happy Sabbath. I have something I want to share with you, and I'm so excited about it. I have beautiful swatches of fabric. Aren't these so very pretty? Oh, I just love fabric. I just, I could spend hours in places like Joann's or Hobby Lobby just looking at the fabric alone. It makes me so happy. And I think to myself, oh, I really wish I could sew. Because if I could sew or quilt, oh, I could just make endless possibilities. But I can't. I'm not crafty like that. But, you know, I just, I love these fabrics. And I think to myself, oh, I really wish I could sew because I could make something pretty. I could make a really pretty tablecloth out of this, don't you think? I think so too. But I do know someone who can make something out of these fabrics and they have made me these beautiful, very pretty masks. Oh, I love these masks and I love this fabric because it turned into something so beautiful and so useful. Yes, indeed. You know, it got me thinking, and I think quite a lot, that God is the same way. We're just these pretty swatches of masks sitting on these fabric bolts, and we don't really have purpose, but we are beautiful, until God takes us and he makes something out of it, like a mask. And, you know, I think that we often underestimate ourselves in our abilities to do things. But I'm going to share a Bible verse with you to share how God can use us. And it comes from Ephesians 2, verses 8 through 10. And I'm going to share it with you today. And it says, For by grace you have been saved through faith, and that not of yourselves. It is the gift of God. For no, of works, lest anyone should boast. For we are his workmanship, created in Christ Jesus for good works, which God prepared beforehand that we should walk in them. Well, what does this mean, you ask? Well, it means that God has created us for a purpose. And our purpose, as it says in verse 10, is for his workmanship to do good works. Well, what does it mean to do good works? Well, how about helping a friend on the playground who fell down? That's a good work. Or lending a pencil to a friend who broke his. Or perhaps sharing a part of your lunch to a friend who doesn't have any. These are good works that God wants us to do because it means that you're doing what he would do. God fed the hungry. God helped those in need. He was all about helping others and it's so beautiful. And so I want you to remember that you might just be a pretty swatch of fabric, but God can do something so much greater than that he can create you into something with purpose. He can create you to do something good. And I just want to remind you that God, no matter how small you feel, he can do anything through you. And I hope and pray that you remember that you are important to God and that you can do all things through Christ who strengthens you. Mm. Amen. I hope you have a beautiful and very blessed day and that you are thoroughly blessed.